Welcome to my classroom. This is my first app built in AngularJS. The idea behind the app was I have an experience, 11 years of experience in teaching, and in teaching we use various apps throughout the day. We have an app for gradebook, we have an app for communicating with parents, we have an app for communicating with students, we have another app to assign assignments and get those assignments back from students. The idea behind my classroom is to create a platform that would allow a one-stop shop for all that to happen. Now, my classroom is written in AngularJS for the front end and does not have a back end. So this is just the beginnings of an app. Um, you'll see that I have a teacher login and a student login. We'll start with teacher. And when you go to the dashboard for the teacher, you'll see the different classes that uh, that teacher has in their, in their uh, schedule. So this teacher has math and pre-AP math. On these directives, you're going to be able to click on an assignment and it'll give you a little bit more detail about that assignment. In future, you would have the ability to add files to your class, message your class, email your class and their parents, either students or parents. And then you'll also have access to your gradebook for that class. If you go into the class, you're going to have three different directives as well. One is a filter for uh, assignments that are coming up soon. Another one is a topics filter, so you can filter through if I just wanted to see my assignments that dealt with fractions or my assignments that dealt with percents. So the way those filters would work, you just click on them. It's going to show whatever you asked to see and click off. The assignments uh, will give you details about that assignment, when it's due, it will allow you to add a comment, uh, same features of adding files, messaging the teacher, messaging the student, emailing the teacher, emailing the student. Up here, they'll have a feature to join another class, remove a class, or maybe edit the class that they're currently on. As far as student side, They're going to see a similar directives. They're going to see their math, science, and ILA classes. If they click on this, it's going to give them details, including the due date, about that assignment. You'll see, notice they'll have the same features of adding files, messaging their teacher, emailing their teacher. But when our, the teachers had access to their grade book, the student's going to have access to just their grade. And the idea is when they click on that grade, it could show them all their assignments and their individual grades uh, for that class. If you go into the class, you're going to see a similar view. Still has the due soon, so if you wanted to look at just at one assignment that was coming up. Uh, topics, you'll be able to view a little bit better in this ILA class because you have reading and then two writing assignments. So if you click on reading, it'll sort everything else out. If you click on writing, it'll show those two writing assignments. Um, some other boring topic, I taught math, so <laughs> my, uh, yeah. Uh, up here, they'll have the same features to join a class or remove a class. They can't add in a class, but they could add their parent to have access. This would allow communication from the teacher to the parent as well. So this is an important feature that would be added later. All right, thanks. That's my introduction to my classroom, a front-end Angular app. I appreciate you watching.